This is a new AZ Audibles. I'm Devin Henry, and joining me today is former Liberty High School Lion and the latest draft pick of the Minnesota Vikings, Kyle Hinton, pick number 253 overall. Can you take me through that night? What were your expectations right before that phone call came in? What was going through your mind when that phone started to ring? Uh, yeah, just me and my family. Uh, they're on, you know, a big Zoom call. I think I had like 30 damn members in the Zoom call. Um, and, you know, just waiting for me to, you know, get a call and, uh, you know, started getting down, you know, to later rounds. And, you know, I saw, you know, the Vikings had a lot of picks. Uh, and they, they've been talking to me, you know, you know pretty heavy uh, throughout the whole draft process. So, um, you know, I, I, I had a, you know, a good feeling that they were going to take a pick on me. So uh, when I did get the call, I mean, I, I, mean, I was kind of surprised and then, you know, you know, half not surprised. So, uh, yeah, but it was, it, was, it was a great moment. So you played for Washburn University in Kansas for two years, a Division II school. When did the reality, when did it all start to feel like it was coming together that becoming an NFL player was starting to materialize? When was that point for you? Uh, yeah, I mean, people have been talking to me since my sophomore year, you know, you know, when I, you know, got, got the starting job as, you know, the left tackle, um, you know, saying like, yeah, you might have a shot and stuff like that. But uh, it, it really didn't materialize for me until – uh, that first scout came out during camp my senior year. Uh, I think it was a Raven scout, and uh, he just came out. And he was just like, "Yeah, uh, you know, we like you. You know, you have some some a chance out here." And then you know, definitely when the Vikings came, uh, I mean, they they were all over me. You know, from the jump, you know, they 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 pulled up my film. They're like, "Yeah, we like you. you I think you'd fit right in." Uh, they're telling me their schemes, and I really like them too. Uh, you know, they they kept in contact with me and everything. Uh, so that's why I really thought they were gonna uh, take a chance on. Before being a dual sport athlete at Washburn, you were a three sport athlete at Liberty High School who just won their first program football state championship in the 6A conference with a combined one division one offer. Everyone wants to try to go pro, but so many of them think that, okay, I need that D1 offer. You didn't have a D1 offer coming out of high school. So for that 80 man roster who just won a state championship, what would you tell them about trying to make it to an NFL roster right now? Uh, yeah, I mean, the biggest thing with the NFL is uh, they just want guys that love football. I mean, they don't really care where you come from, uh, you know, what school you went to. They just want guys that, you know, that can play hard, uh, and, you know, just, just love the game. Uh, you know, even at the, at the bigger D1 schools, I mean, not everybody just loves football. I mean, people play the game for different reasons. Uh, but, you know, NFL-wise, you know, you just play anywhere and just, just show that you love the game. And, you know, you should, you should get a chance you know, no matter where you go. You are part of Coach Mark Smith's first season with that team and then last season being his final season, actually. Were you able to take anything from your two years playing at Liberty? Any experiences, any lessons that you're able to take through college with you? Oh, yeah, definitely just, like, with adversity. Uh, you know, just, you know, coming into Liberty, uh, you know, I was a little bit behind. Uh, you know, I moved in pretty late. I think I came in in August my junior year. Uh, but, you know, the, the coach, uh, you know, also gave me a chance that, you know, they spent extra time with me, you know, to catch me up and everything on the plays. Uh, you know, and that's kind of where I was when, you know, I got to I got to Washburn. You know, I was a little bit behind a little bit uh, with, the, you know, they wanted me to start early, uh, you know, get playing time early. So, you know, I you know, just kind of, you know, thrown, thrown to the fire a little bit. Uh, but, you know, with my time at Liberty and, you know, learning how to, uh, you know, adjust quickly, you know, I, you know, I, I take that. I took that in, you know, in stride when I got to Washburn. So uh, definitely, you know, Liberty helped me out uh, a lot, you know, in, in that aspect. Talking with Kyle Hinton, Minnesota Vikings offensive lineman. Let's talk a little bit about the process now with the coronavirus and COVID-19, this pandemic kind of mixing things up. What's the next steps for you right now in terms of trying to communicate with the team, communicating with coaches, uh, get, getting your jersey number? What does the next steps look like for you just trying to get to Minnesota? Uh, yeah, I mean, we're just waiting to see it right now. Uh, you know, I mean, they, they still have, you know, training camp, you know, in July, but that could get, you know, pushed back. Uh, but right now, I mean, it's, it's pretty easy, you know, uh, talking to coaches and like, things like that. Uh, they, you know, they send us iPads and, you know, we, you know, we have meetings every day, uh, you know, on Microsoft Teams. Uh, you know, we just go through plays and we do, we do all we can, uh, you know, that we can do. So, uh, I mean, it's not, it's not too much of a, a, a difference or a, a challenge. Uh, but, you know, we just, we just can't wait to, you know, get back on the field. So, And so right now, how do you prepare to try to go up against NFL veterans for a spot on that 53-man roster when you can't even go to the facility? 
Uh, yeah, I mean, I mean, I can still work out and everything. Uh, you know, they, the strength coach, you know, sent us, uh, you know, really detailed plan and, uh, of, you know, how to stay in shape, uh, we, you know, with whatever you have and uh, things like that. And, uh, you know, I, I don't, I don't, you know, see as much of a challenge, you know, the, you know, to get ready because, you know, I've, I've already played an NFL PA game, you know, I, you know, I know what I can do and, uh, you know, I just, I'm just trying to, you know, stay on my path, you know, uh, so it's not, it's not too much of a challenge. Kyle Henton, the latest Arizona talent in the NFL. First of all, congrats. And second of all, thank you for joining me today, Kyle. Yeah, appreciate you having me.